Well, the Sacramento Kings defeat the Portland Trailblazers 120 to 80. The score irrelevant in the big picture. The win very relevant because with that win, Sacramento clinching a playoff spot for the first time in 17 years, Katie, as well as home court in the first round with a top four seed. It just feels like organization wide. There was so much leading up to this moment. There's a big exhale and a well-deserved exhale. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I'm having a hard time <laughs> holding it together because I've been here from the very beginning of the playoff drought and I've seen this city that loves their team and this organization that has fought to keep it here and ownership and they have gone through a lot. They've mm -hmm. struggled and I haven't allowed myself up to this moment to think about it because I didn't want to right. to get ahead of myself. I knew it was going to happen, but once it happened, all of that washes over you and you realize that the players deserve it, the coaching staff deserve it, deserve it. but man, does this city yeah. deserve it? Does this fan base all the way from Sacramento to Danny in England, all the way across the country, the fans that have shown up, that have followed, that have been there ride or die through the whole thing. I'm so happy for this fan base. You deserve it. And it was well deserved. It did not happen by chance. It did not happen by luck. It was by design. It was done through the hard work of Vivek Ranadive, Monty McNair, Wes Wilcox, first year head coach Mike Brown, and the assembled players who put it together this year. And, you know, there were no moments like in previous seasons of seven, eight, game losing streaks this was a team that when things started to go a little bit left it was corrected in the moment by their head coach and we see what's happened as a result good things coming to fruition and man when we look forward now to the playoffs I mean can't imagine what game one is going to be like at Golden One Center of the playoffs. It's going to be lit. Yeah. <laughs> and we're going to light the beam. We're going to enjoy it. We're going to relish in it. We're going to appreciate it. And that's the important part. The great thing about Mike Brown and his approach is that it's great that we won tonight. You know that's what he's saying inside the locker room. But he's always been saying his mantra is, I didn't come here just to play in playoff games. That's what he said in his introductory news conference. I came here to win championships. He'll get a chance to write that check with his players in the playoffs moving forward. Thanks.